How you doing, Frank? I'm fine, man. What's going on? Uh, I had a party last night. Yeah? Yeah. Well, come on, sit down. Have a drink with me. <clears throat> How's that job going? How are your savings holding up? Fine. <laughs> Listen, man, I'm the big brother here. I'm supposed to be looking out for you, remember? That page there is pretty blank. Ah, uh, that is something new. What happened to your other novel? I put it away for now. How many rejections this time? Three hundred forty-two. Listen, I'm not quitting on it yet. All right, I just got tired of writing query letters again. I, I, I got the urge to to express something else. Huh? I just don't quite know what that is yet. Bro, well, if there's one thing I know about you, it's that you never give up. You never have. And you know what? what? That might be your problem. <laughs> okay. Do you know why I always beat you at poker? Shut the fuck up, bro. I don't always lose at poker. Because you games. never know <laughs> when to fold your damn cards. Oh. Okay, so now that you got this big job and you're making all this money, what, you know everything now? Listen, I told you, I'm, I'm fine, okay? <clears throat> Come on, man, sit down, I'm, uh, I'm proud of you. Come on. Dad asked about you. Yeah, what did he say? He wanted to know, you know, if you had a job, another woman. Of course I have a job. He knows I've got a job. He meant a real job, man. Look, you tried, but it didn't work out. It's time to fold your cards and cash what chips you have left. Ow. Listen, man, I think, I know you think you're doing the right thing, but you're not. I'm not. No, coming here telling me to quit on being me, and you didn't do the right thing choosing the path you're on either. Don't give me this poetic bullshit. Do you plan on retiring with this company? Yeah, sure, why not? What's wrong with that? Oh, so you see yourself 30 years from now working for this company. Why wouldn't I? You seem to forget that I know you, little brother. No, you don't. You know who you wanted me to be. That's it. Listen, man. I only wanted you to be you. What makes you think I'm not being me? <sighs> okay. <clears throat> so when you woke up this morning, do you remember feeling that sadness you used to talk about? I met someone. She works there. If you knew how much I care about her, you'd know it wouldn't matter what job it was, if it meant I could be with her. Of course it matters, man. If... <laughs> Listen, if you're not being you, then this whole relationship would just be built on a lie. What the fuck are you talking about? Are you still drunk? Look, man, I came here to offer you a job. At your company. Yeah, but it's not what you think. The only position open was the janitorial position. Is that all a liberal arts degree qualifies me for? I hate to say it, but yeah. Get the fuck out of here, man. <clears throat> Dude, I tell... <laughs> I thought you were here just to shoot the shit, catch up. I'm here because mom and dad told me to come here. Your phone's disconnected, they're worried. Coming from the guy that calls them what, once a year? Oh, whatever, man, you're hopeless. Yeah, no, you are.
You remember this? What? That. You broke that. I did. You stayed up all night writing that. You don't remember? It was a great read. <laughs>